pretty good. Yeah. Hi, Facebook. Missing in action. Kevin Richards coming back with you. I think it's been about a month, unfortunately. I'm sorry, Facebook. Facebook, I'm sorry. I've been missing. I'm back. We've had, you know, I'm not even going to go through the excuses. There's been some reasons, but I'm back. So what I'm going to show you three, uh, three different checkered flags today that I'm going to show you probably for sure, at least three more next week. Um, but they're all kind of in this area. So we're going to start right here. We're going to start with this 2018 uh, Nissan Rogue SV, uh, 25,000 mile on an 18. Good, uh, good vehicle, late model, low miles. What's nice about the 18 SV trim versus SV trims in prior years is there's a lot of equipment uh, that comes standard now on the SV. We got backup camera. Uh, we got, uh, I believe, heated cloth seats. Uh, yes, heated cloth seats. I can see the buttons in there. Um, and potentially even remote start, but don't hold me to that. Check our descriptions on the website. But, uh, but these are all things now that are standard on the SV trim that used to only be add-ons either through a popular equipment package or to go to an SL trim, which is the top of the line. So really an excellent value of equipment, the fuel efficiency, four-wheel drive, all-wheel drive, SUV performance, and in price. So you kind of get it all with this in one more week. Uh, check your flag until it's gone. So definitely come and look at this one. Um, we're going to swing over here now uh, to uh, very nice uh, 2015 Lexus RX 350. Now, if you've never ridden in a Lexus, you really should. I never had, I'll be dead honest with you. So I took this thing for a ride. I'm like, you know, what's the big deal? And then I jumped in it and I'm like, oh, that's the big deal. It really does ride very, very nicely. They're, they're, they handle, they're, they're, it, you feel good and solid behind the wheel. Um, and of course, you know, they are a, they are a high-end luxury SUV, but the price in this is exceptional, especially now that it's reached checkered flag, which if you haven't seen any of the other segments, best price uh, to mileage ratio, 75 uh, to 100 mile radius is what checkered flag means. Also means we only have a maximum of two weeks to buy it if you're interested, so don't drag your feet. Now this is a 15, like I say, 31,000 mile. RX 350, I'm not gonna go over the equipment because they pretty much come equipped with everything. Uh, you name it on a premium SUV trim, this has it. You know, backup camera, remote start, heated seats, uh, nav, roof, the, the, the whole uh, gamut there. Um, but uh, dark gray exterior, um, you know, dark gray interior leather. Uh, just that, again, a very nice, solid, sturdy, uh, very well equipped luxury SUV. Uh, at an affordable price. So uh, make sure if you're interested, you come and check that out. Now, the last one's across the way here. It also is an all-wheel drive, even though it's not an SUV like the prior to. Uh, it's a sedan, but it is an all-wheel drive Ford Fusion. Now, I will tell you we do have an approved credit app on this vehicle. Doesn't mean it's sold, but it does mean that, you know, there is a chance somebody could take it here today. Uh, but it is a 2016 Ford Fusion SE all-wheel drive, as I said, with the EcoBoost, which is a Turbo 4. Uh, 32,000 miles on this one. Uh, again, good equipment. Uh, just the cloth, no nam, the roof. Uh, but it does have uh, all your other popular equipment, backup camera, uh, things of that nature, power options. Um, very, very good price on this car. And like I say, 16.3, I think, is what it is right now. You get your all-wheel drive capability and get excellent fuel mileage. And they give you a little sporty look. They got the wing and, and a couple of little other options to give a little bit of a sport look to it as well. So there you have it. All three all-wheel drives, all three excellent deals, uh, and all three about to go out of here one way or the other. So if you're interested, don't delay. Come back. I, I shouldn't promise because I've been bad, but I really do think I'm going to be here next week to show you some more. So I appreciate your time today, guys. Have a great one. We'll see you the next time.